as a professional YouTuber, being accused of clickbait comes with the territory. But let me defend myself by saying that actual clickbait is called that because it lures people into clicking into their content or article with promises of wild themes or impossible possibilities. And then after the viewer has been baited, they under deliver or underwhelm or have just outright lied in the actual content. I don't clickbait. If my thumbnail says I paint with an RC car, I paint with an RC car. If my thumbnail tells you that I'm going to be painting upside down, making art with garbage, sculpting stone, or painting with a drone, or getting a tattoo, I live up to those promises. With, of course, the exception of the blood artwork video I released a few weeks back. I definitely didn't kill my sworn enemies and use their blood to paint a picture. I promise. G'day ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Draw with Jazza, I'm Jazza and this video is the announcement of a theme for an art competition with an exciting batch of prizes, an awesome theme, but before we get to that, I want to remind anyone who wants to enter to go check out the info page, top link in the description where it has all of the rules and all of the guidelines to enter and everything I talk about in this video as well, all touched on in detail that you can consume at your own pace. On top of that, if you want to make sure you get notified of an art competition as soon as it's launched and get the announcement of the winners as soon as they're released, make sure to subscribe to the newsletter at the top of that webpage where you can then make sure you're notified as soon as the announcement of those things comes out. So with that said, let's jump into the theme of this art competition, which I have titled Future Clickbait. In the last decade, we have seen clickbait evolve and intensify. Earlier on, it was occasional wild articles or some larger bosoms in thumbnails and that sort of thing. But over time, clickbait and social media feed manipulation have gone to shape culture and communities and even elections. What I pose to you in this art competition is the question, what does the future of clickbait look like? And what is the effect of that? on humanity. Now you could go in a lot of different directions with this. You could go wildly futuristic and super dystopian. You could go maybe 10, 20 years in the future. The uh, the time at which we're in the future is up to you and the intensity of the depiction or the seriousness of the depiction is also up to you. But use your imagination and creativity and as much of your art skills as you can muster to depict an illustration, traditional or digital is fine. That represents what an interesting future may look like as a result of clickbait constantly intensifying and affecting the way society functions. As always, this art competition is divided into two categories, the open and the beginner category. So if you want to enter the beginner category, make sure you only do so if you're very young or very new to art. Otherwise, even if you don't feel like you're at a professional level or feel like you'd be able to compete in the open category, just make sure to leave the beginner category for actual beginners. To enter the art competition, make sure to upload your final piece to newgrounds.com on the art portal, link is in the description, and tag your piece with one of two words. Future clickbait, all one word, to enter the open category, or B dash future clickbait to enter the beginner category. That's B hyphen future clickbait or one word. Don't tag any other pieces that you have on that website with either of those tags twice because then you'll be automatically disqualified. And having mentioned a few rules briefly, just make sure to check out the list of rules that I'm a bit too bored to read out loud in this video, but are there for you to read. And there's also that page I mentioned also that you can consume them to your heart's content. It may be too boring for me to read, but they're definitely essential for you to follow. And I run this show so I can do what I want. But you can't. You gotta do what I want, because I'm the boss around you. <laughs> so without any further ado, let's jump into the exciting matter of prizes for this competition. The runner-up of the beginning category will receive an item of their choosing from the jazzastudios.com shop. My shop contains all sorts of digital goodies for you to check out from entertainment like the Arty Games app to practical like my Photoshop brushes and to educational like my ebooks or my video course on animation. There's photo references, archives and a whole bunch more. Go check it out and anything you get there is a huge support to me in the channel. So link is in the description and thank you for your support. The winner of the beginner category will also receive an item of their choosing from the jazzastudios.com shop, as well as a signed copy of my how to draw book, Draw with Jazza Creating Characters, your go-to guide for character design and having fun with the design process. The beginner category winner will also receive a Huion Inspiroy H640P tablet. This device has a battery-free stylus, 8,192 levels of pressure sensitivity, six customizable express keys and switch, and an ultra-thin design. It's a fantastic portable device and entry point into digital art and animation, and Huion 
Patreon is giving members of my community 10% off using the coupon code JAZZA640. Go check it out with the link in the description. And remember, it's only available for a limited time. The winner of the beginner category will also receive six months of free premium Skillshare membership, a site with over 24,000 courses in illustration, drawing, design, animation, and more. It really is an amazing place for you to learn and even make a little money on the side if you want to teach there and share your skills. Whether you want to brush up on your current skill set or learn something completely new, I highly recommend Skillshare as a fantastic learning community. And if you want a place to start, go check out my courses, one on how to be a YouTuber and another on how to present to camera, which I'm sure you'll enjoy. The link is in the card in the description and Skillshare is providing viewers of this video and my community two months of free premium Skillshare membership with access to all of their courses for a limited time. So go check it out. Once again, the link is in the card and in the description. Now on to the open category. First, a pool of finalists will be selected. They will all be eligible for voting in the community prize, which we'll get to in a moment. And all of them will also receive a free copy of my custom Photoshop brush pack available on the jazzastudios.com shop. The runner up of the beginner category will receive an item of their choosing from the jazzastudios.com shop, a signed copy of my book, Draw with Jazz Creating Characters, six months of free premium Skillshare membership, and they will be eligible for the community prize. And the winner of the open category, as well as receiving an item of their choosing from the jazzastudios.com shop, will receive one year's full premium membership on Skillshare.com, as well as a brand new Canvas Pro 12 tablet. Now this device has not even been released yet, but I can give a pretty accurate guess based on my review of the Canvas Pro 13, that it's gonna be a really pro device. And viewers of this video, if you're interested in getting one, now is the time to grab it for 15% off and this offer ends the 26th of November, so get in quick. The links are in the description, so go check it out. The device features 11.6 inches, a similar size to a sketchbook you might carry around with you, and the pen features 8,192 levels of pressure sensitivity and tilt support. The display of the tablet features 120% sRGB color gamut and presents 16.7 million vivid colors. With a full laminated anti-glare glass screen and it comes with a portable adjustable stand. An amazing product for an amazing price and an even better price with that 15% off, so get in quick. So there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, the rules and prizes and theme for this art competition and the deadline for the art competition as listed on that website and in the description is Tuesday the 11th of December, so make sure to get all your entries in by then. Sometimes there's the question of time zones, will it be included if it's blah blah blah. If it's the 11th of December, wherever you are, you're okay as long as you su submit by then, just don't wait till the 12th. Otherwise that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I wanted to keep it short and sweet and I think I'd like to do that for future announcements to cut to the chase so you guys can cut to the art creation. All the best of luck with your art and I can't wait to see your entries. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, I'll see you later. Make sure to subscribe to my channel to see more of my videos. And while you're at it, check out my shop where I sell eBooks, brushes, photo references, video courses, and more. There's another video you might enjoy from my channel over there. And you can also check out my behind the scenes daily vlog channel, Daily Jazza. That's it for now. And until next time, I'll see you later.